what it allowed us to do was pull into there. There's a little ramp that comes off the front of this. The astronauts could walk straight off, come in through those doors, come into here, be checked by medical. There was another door on the other side that allowed a scissor truck to pull up because they had time sensitive uh, materials on their experiments. So they could immediately start downloading all of the stuff too. Typically from the time that we had wheels stop, okay, till the time we got it back to the MDD, the mate demate device, was between five and seven hours. So you can kind of see here uh, as we progress through, there, there it is pulled up through the orbiter. So the astronauts would get in, into the orbiter, okay? Then they would back this up, lower it back down, and the astronauts would come out those back steps because they wanted to walk around the orbiter and find out what kind of hits it took, did we have any chip tiles. And uh, you'll see here in some further pictures, I captured some of them walking down the stairs. There they are coming down. And uh, just meeting, that's our actually our center director, Dave McBride, so he goes out and meets with them. And then the rest is, is um, pretty much just making sure everything tries to go as smooth as possible, making sure all this equipment that hooks up runs smoothly. Uh, they had a unit here. You can see these big hoses. They hooked that up. They called it the cool unit. And that's what cooled the orbiter and all the uh, avionics. Because, you know, you're out there for five to seven hours. All that the electronics is still up. There's a team of people in there from Kennedy and Johnson Space Center. They're downloading data and getting experiments off immediately. They're out there the whole time that we're getting that ready to come back in. So they had to keep the unit cooled off and that's what they called it was the cool unit. And uh, that's actually a couple of guys that worked for me. And uh, like, a, there's a ruggedly handsome gentleman. <laughs> uh, and then more astronaut stuff. And then just different shots. That's actually the what we called the K mag, and that was the cool unit. That's what pulled up and cooled it. And then this was one of those days that it was a really long day. You'll see as we progress through here, the, the, uh, the sun is starting to to dissipate. And then, uh, as they can say, we're putting it to rest. So that's just kind of in a nutshell, kind of what we did for for NASA and you know our company.